Hey there, future scientists! Did you know your car's exhaust fumes hide something super valuable? It's true! We're talking about platinum and palladium. These metals are hiding in a part called the catalytic converter. They're called precious metals for a reason. First, they're super rare, it takes a whole lot of ore to find just a tiny bit. Second, they're super useful. They help clean up the nasty stuff coming out of your car's tailpipe. Platinum and palladium are in demand, which makes them valuable. We're talking big bucks. Now I'm not saying you should start collecting catalytic converters from the neighborhood, it's important to get them legally and ethically. But if you have access to a catalytic converter and want to see the science behind these precious metals, let's get extracting. Before we start our experiment we need the right tools. Safety is important so we'll be using some strong stuff. Remember, always ask a grown-up for help before handling anything dangerous. Here's what we'll need. A catalytic converter, of course. This is where the platinum and palladium hang out. Safety goggles and gloves. We need to protect those peepers and paws. A well-ventilated area. The chemicals we'll use can get a little fumy. A mask. Keep those lungs clean and safe. Hydrochloric acid. This strong acid will help us dissolve the metals. Nitric acid. Another strong acid to help with the process. Aqua regia. This is a super strong mixture of hydrochloric acid and nitric acid. Filter paper and funnel. These will help us separate the metals from the other stuff beaker and heat source. We'll need these to heat our solutions. Remember these materials can be dangerous if not handled properly. Always get help from a responsible adult and follow safety guidelines. Now, before we start mixing and heating things up, we need to talk about safety. It's like wearing a helmet when you ride a bike. Better safe than sorry. First, always wear your safety goggles and gloves when working with acids. These chemicals can seriously harm your skin and eyes. Remember, safety first. Second, work in a well-ventilated area or outdoors. The fumes from the acids can be harmful if you breathe them in. Open those windows wide. Third, never pour water into acid, it can cause a dangerous reaction. Always add acid to water slowly, like a gentle rain shower. Finally, if you accidentally spill any acid, don't panic. Neutralize it with baking soda before cleaning it up. And always, always tell an adult about any spills or accidents. Now, for the fun part, extracting those precious metals, here's a simplified version of the process. First, we need to crush the catalytic converter to get to the good stuff inside, the honeycomb structure coated with platinum and palladium. Think of it like cracking open a geode to find the crystals inside. Next we'll use a process called leaching, we'll soak the crushed material in aqua regia. This super strong acid dissolves the platinum and palladium, separating them from the other stuff. After leaching we filter the solution to remove any solid